Hey guys, Chris Giddens here. I'm standing outside a pillar of the Lake Martin area, JR Sports Bar and Grill. Everybody around here knows that one of their famous deals is a leche eat off the kids menu for $1.99 if you're in uniform. So I'm going to ease up here. I found a kid's uniform, and I'm going to get Miss Ann to let me eat off that kid's menu for $1.99. I was wondering if I could eat off the kid's menu since I'm in uniform. Well, no, you're what? too old. You don't have, there's not a sign that has an age limit on it. No, but still, it ought to tell you that you can't eat if you're over 12. I got a uniform. Is that what you call that? I got it from a high school. Okay, said, if you say that, I, I'll buy that. I don't know why they give eat. it to me. You can't eat for $1.99. Well, you know I don't eat a lot. Yeah, right. <laughs> All right, Miss Ann, well, let's, let's go in here and talk about it then, okay? Just like that, you're not. All right, I'll change clothes. Y'all stick around. Me and Miss Ann are going to come back. We're going to talk a minute, and I'm going to eat for $1.99. I've already decided. Okay, gotcha. I just got changed clothes from out of my uniform because Miss Ann, as nice as she is, would not feed me for $1.99. Couldn't tell you why, but I was lucky enough to get her to sit down with me for a minute. Miss Ann, how are you tonight? I'm fine. How about you? Oh, boy, if I was any better than maybe peeing a cup to check on me, I'm telling you what. Miss Ann, how long have you guys been open here? 14 years. 14 years. And JR's, everybody in Ellic City knows where JR's is. Yep, we've been here so long, everybody knows where we're at. I mean, everybody, and not just being here such a long time, but the atmosphere here, it's unlike anywhere else. There's not, I, I can't think of a single place that's really got a legitimate sports bar atmosphere other than JR's right here in the beautiful Lake Martin area. No, and most of the time, it's young middle-aged and older people. I mean, they just all get along real good right here. It, it, you can't beat that, and I, I know you've got some, uh, you got a little special area up there I like to get into sometimes, and, uh, you know, it, it, it make us a family show, but I, I like that area back up there upstairs. Y'all got to check that out. You, you do so much for this community, including um, helping out with all kind of sports activities. What are the rules for the kids' menu and uniforms? From, the, from little ones to 12 years old, like for $1.99 with a uniform on. Okay, so there is a age limit somewhere down the line. Exactly. You know, I feel like maybe you should write that on a door or something. You ain't thought about that? Or? No, most have people a lot, know that. You don't have a lot of problems like that? No. Okay. Uh, well, Miss Ann, I, I can't thank you enough for sitting down and talking to me. I know you're super busy, oh, yeah. but that's not an unfamiliar sight here at JR's, is it? No. No. Not, not to be busy is not an unfamiliar sight. Now, now, let me ask you this. Uh, I, I know you guys, y'all, you, you can get order in here. You can call in an order. Y'all deliver too, right? Exactly. And, the and then within the city limits. And then y'all also cater, right? Yes. Now, let, let me ask you this. How do, how do I get in touch um, with, with somebody about the catering? Just call JR's. Call JR. What's the number? It's 329-2328. 329-2328. In, in relation to the world, where, where is JR Sports Bar? It's at 145 Alabama Street in Alexander City, Alabama. Now, if anybody has lived in Alex City for a minute, uh, don't know road names like that, you, you can always tell out of town is because they be asking you road name, where Church Street? See, I don't ever know that. you got to pick something with a restaurant on it, and I know that road. You know what I mean? I don't know what this road's called. It's the road by JR's, you know what I mean? Yes, exactly. That's 22. So, so let me ask you this, Ed. Um, if we, in relation to, for the people that's lived here for a long time, and maybe they don't know about JR's, they haven't been here for a while uh, here in our viewing area. This has always been JR's. So you guys have just tried and true, and you know what works, right? You know what works. Awesome. Fantastic. You're right here. You're smack in the middle of downtown. Great spot. Exactly. Right across from the park, right across from Chamber of Commerce. Right over there where they do Jazz Fest and all that stuff. Exactly. So This is a, a, a very familiar part of Ellic City. People are always familiar with this, and uh, JR's is a big reason for that. And uh, like I said, I can't thank you for the pillar that you are in our community and what you've done for these people. Thank you very much for that. And uh, for the kids especially, my goodness, you're, you're always so, uh, so eager to help out those kids, especially those involved in sports. But, uh, hey, I thank the kids and their parents, because without them, I wouldn't have been here 14 years. I mean, that is a long time, isn't it? Yeah, let me ask you, how did you get into the restaurant game? JR's was originally owned by Ron Gray, and I worked for Ron Gray. 
and Ron Gray went out of business, and I asked him if I could have his menu, and he gave it to me. Then I went to John Allen, and I asked if I could have the building, and he told me I'd never survive. But he let me have it for six months. At the end of the three months, he walked in and said, well, you made out of me. <laughs> and that was the end of it. <laughs> And you've been here ever since. I've been bro. here ever since. Well, you can't beat that way. You're the special sauce in that has to make JR's great. And again, for all our new people, I know there's some people here watching that's never been to Lake Martin before. There's people that's watching that come down here on vacation don't know about JR's. You got anything you'd like to say to, to people that's maybe not from this area, come down touring and, and visiting the lake? Do you got anything to say to them? Just come on down to Ellick City and, and try out JR's. You'll come back. There you go. So you heard it here. You will come back. You just got to come down here. I'm going to tell you the friendliest folks around, some of the best food. Obviously, your cooks uh, do a fantastic job. I'm going to get back there and race them here in a minute, and we're going to have some fun with your cooks and your waitresses. Uh, I'm pretty sure that I'm – you know, I did the restaurant game for a long time. I think I can beat him. What do you think? I think so, too. You think, you think I can whoop him? Yeah. So Miss Ann's going to offer me a job when all this is said and done, and I whoop her cook. Hey, guys, hang around. Let's get involved back here in the kitchen, okay? Hey, I'm Chris Giddens. Welcome back with The Lake Life. Standing back here right now with the main night cook, Drew. JR Sports Burger. Now, now, you're in charge of these fingers right here, right? Yes, sir. All right, now, tell, tell me what makes these special. What's the special ingredient? I can't really tell you all that. Now, why can't you tell me? Because then everybody will know. Yeah, all right, that's fair enough. That's fair enough. Okay. Well, let me ask you this, then. Uh, how, how long you worked here, Drew? Uh, a year and a half. About a year and a half. Now, um, this stuff back here, have they told you the secret recipe? How long do you have to work here do you find out? Uh, six months. Six months, and then you find out. Okay, so i got to find me somebody in here that's at about five and a half months, and we'll work that out. Okay, never mind. Don't worry about that. Hey, man, let me ask you something. Does it get just crazy busy back here? Yes, it does. I mean, and it gets busy quick, too, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Now, now let me ask you this. I don't, I don't guess y'all do no catering, do you? Oh, yeah. You do catering? Yeah. How much catering you do? A bunch. Good answer. Hey, man, I tell you what, buddy. Y'all have got just a gang of stuff going on back here. Now, I don't know if you know this, but I've worked at a handful of kitchens before myself. Really? I'm just saying, <laughs> uh, can you uh, not just eat now? I mean, working, too. <laughs> All right, here's what I'm wondering. Okay, if I can't figure out the secret recipe, and now I know you're doing your grilled chicken. I know y'all are doing your French fries. Y'all got all this crazy stuff going on, toast going. Man, if I if you ain't too busy, you reckon you'd let me throw down a few of these chicken fingers here? If you want to, yeah. You think I could? All right, well, let me. You, can do it. you think I could do it? Yeah. I used to be really good at battering chicken fingers. I'm just telling you. All right, listen, I got an idea. Y'all stay tuned. Let me get some gloves on. Me and Drew about to cut up. All right. I'm back here with Drew and got my gloves on, my apron on, and uh, it's getting about that time for me to show Drew how things are done around here because uh, he seems to doubt my skills. One, two, three, eight, nine, and see, I'm going to go on and do 11 just okay. because I think I'm better than you that much, okay? okay. Here's what we're going to do. We've got 10 fingers. Well, he's got 10. I got 11. That's just because I already know. Um, me and him are going to race battering these fingers to that fryer right there. So. Y'all, hang right here. Let's see if he's really got what it takes. Count it down for me. Give me a good, loud three, two, one. Let me know when it gets done. I'll be over here. But now we got to see and look how they look. Cause I may, am I won? Did I win? Did I win? No, did I, didn't. Why didn't I win? My mom was in the grease first, right? Yeah. So I didn't win because we ain't, we don't see what they look like yet. Okay, okay. But first stage, you still here at Jr's, and right now sitting at the table waiting on Drew to bring out these fingers, and let's figure out whose are the best. Here he comes. I already know I got mine done quicker. Let's see whose looks better. All right, now, Drew, in your expert opinion, which plate of these fingers look better? In my opinion, I would have to say these. Let me look at them here, and let me see what I think. Okay. Okay. You know what, Drew? I agree with you. These are the better-looking chicken fingers. Here's the moment of truth. Which one of these is your plate? 
that one. You're lying. I do not believe it. Really? Really. Are you saying I'm that rusty, really? Yes, that is what I'm saying. All right, Drew. Well, that's about all I got for you. Thank you. Guys, come check him out. JR, as you see, he is the chicken finger king. Come check him out. Hey, hang on. I'm about to pull me a waitress over here, and we're going to talk a little smack. Hey, Chris Giddens here. We're just settling down at JR's. I'm going to see if I can't snag a waitress. What are some of the more popular items you guys do here? Well, we do sell a lot of chicken fingers, of course. No. Right. <laughs> and our fried pickles are a top seller, of course. Can I tell you what my favorite thing is, and this may be crazy, the rooster salad. Have you had that? Yes, I have. I enjoy it. I like all the jalapenos and the cheese and salsa. And, and then they always, any order you get here at JR's, they're always going to bring you two sauces. One's their special sauce, and one's the ranch. A lot of people like the ranch, and it's good. It's all homemade. That, that special sauce is really special good, too. sauce as well is homemade. But, guys, you got to come out here to JR's Sports Bar and Grill, backbone of Ellick City, has been a pillar of this community for a long time. Come check us out. Thank you so much for talking to me. I'm sitting here with Miss Ann again at JR's, the place to be in Ellick City. Uh, I see you got me worked out. What is this, a ribeye? Exactly. Uh, so this is my $1.99? Not hardly. Oh, well, I guess I better get started eating. Uh, Miss Ann, give them the line. Thanks for coming to JR's. See you on the lake.